Welcome to Chinta Statistics and Data Science. Today we are going to solve this problem from IIT MMS 2022, problem number 50. The problem says that let x1 through x25 be a random sample from a normal mu comma 1 distribution where mu is a real number which is unknown. Consider the testing of hypothesis h0 mu equals to 5.2 against h1 mu equals to 5.6. The null hypothesis is rejected if and only if 1 by 25 summation xi is greater than k for some constant k. If the size of the test is 0 0.05, then the probability of type 2 error equals what? So we have a random sample from this distribution. So x1 through x25 follows iid normal mu comma 1, right? And we have to test mu equals to 5.2 versus mu equals to 5.6 and reject h0 if and only if x bar here 1 by 25 into summation xi is nothing but x bar, right? The sample mean. So x bar greater than k and the size is said to be 0 0.05. So it is nothing but probability under h0, reject h0 is 0 0.05, right? Because this is the size of the test. So it is probability under h0, reject h0. Now under h0, the random sample follows iid normal 5.2 comma 1, right? Because h0 says that the mean is mu is 5.2. So under the assumption of h0, under the assumption that h0 is true, the random sample follows iid normal. 5.2 comma 1 so x bar follows normal 5.2 comma 1 by 25 right therefore 5 into x bar minus 5.2 follows normal 0 1 this thing right now probability at a under h naught rejecting h naught is nothing but x bar greater than k right we are told that to reject h naught if and only if x bar is greater than k so probability under h naught x bar greater than k is 0 0.05 now Subtract subtracting minus five subtracting five point two from both sides and multiplying by five both sides we get five into x bar minus five point two is greater than five into k minus five point two is point zero five right so now this thing is standard normal so let it be z so probability z greater than this thing is point zero five now see if z is a standard normal distribution then probability z greater than z alpha is alpha right this is the upper cutoff point this is that this z alpha this number is called the upper cutoff point because after this value the probability that the random variable exceeds this value is alpha so therefore this thing since z greater than this thing is 0 0.05 therefore this thing this entire thing is actually nothing but z 0 0.05 right z 0 0.05 therefore k is nothing but 5.2 plus z 0 0.05 by 5 right so we have found out k now you might be thinking what is z.05 which is it, it can easily be found from the normal table and its value is actually given in the problem in the paper so see given capital phi of 1.645 is 0.95 right that means probability z less than equals 1.645 is 0 0.95 right this thing this is given in the question paper so probability z less than equals this is this. Therefore, probability z greater than 1.645 is actually 0 0.05, right? Therefore, this thing must be since probability z greater than this is 0 0.05. Therefore, this means that z 0 0.05 is nothing but 1.645. That means we have found out k is equals to 5.2 plus this thing, which turns out to be 5.529. Therefore, reject h not even only if x bar is greater than 5.529. This is the size 0 0.05 test. We have found now probability of type 2 error is nothing but 1 minus probability under h1 reject h0 right probability under h1 1 minus probability under h1 reject h0 so under h1 x bar follows normal 5.6 comma 1 by 25 right because h1 says that the mu is mu is 5.6 not 5.2 so under h1 x bar follows normal 5.6 comma 1 by 25 that means 5 into x bar minus 5.6 follows standard normal so again just standardizing both sides we get this thing this standardizing both sides we get 1 minus probability z greater than minus 0.355 which means probability z less than equals minus 0.355 which is capital phi of minus 0.355 now this thing is nothing but 1 minus capital phi of 0.355 that means the answer is this is given this capital phi of 0.355 is, is 0.6387 this is given in the question paper so we already know this one and ultimately the answer it turns out to be 0 0.63 0 0.3613 0 0.3613 so ultimately the answer the top type 2 error is nothing but this thing 
0.3613. So this is the answer to the problem. So it was a very easy problem actually. Everything was given as long as, as you know the basic definitions of the size and type one error, type two error. That's uh, the only thing is needed for this problem. It's a very easy problem. So there you have it, the solution to this problem. So do like, share, and subscribe to the channel for more exciting problems. See you till next time.